A woman living in Sugarland was assaulted last month while taking out the trash. Here's our reporter Fessel Kayumi with an update on the incident. I'm here at an affluent neighborhood in Sugarland, Texas, where just a few blocks away, a woman was beaten and assaulted while taking out her trash just last month. The family, police officials, and investigators are still looking for clues on who the suspect or suspects might have been. The attack happened in the 20 block of Wilmington Court at approximately 7.05 p.m. on November 5th. The victim, Mrs. Tehani, was attacked on the street in front of her house. According to records, she believes she was hit in the head by a flashlight. Mrs. Tahani's daughter spoke about the effect the attack has left on her. After that attack, the image of her disfigured face has not left my face, n left my mind not once. She needed to have 52 stitches done and weeks of rest in order to physically recover from the pain that she endured. We're asking the public to please, please help us find who did this with any tips and information with a $10,000 reward in, through Crime Stoppers. The culprits are still out there and she needs closer, closure so she can finally leave the house peacefully and the city can be a safer place. Please help us in order to prevent this from happening to her or anyone else again. Sergeant Matt Levan from the Sugarland Police Department says as of right now, two suspects are wanted and the department also released edited video footage from neighboring cameras. The suspects arrived in what is believed to be a black Chevy Tahoe. Police officials believe this was a premeditated attack as the vehicle had been parked outside for almost an hour. Mrs. Tahani also talked about how difficult it has been for her since that night. Scared. Can't get out of the house. Um, scared all the time, even in the daytime. Just want to know why it happened. Trying to think, but... And actually, they were there even the night before. They were waiting outside for an hour and the next night when they assaulted me. During the incident, the man, who was covered in dark clothing, made no demands and did not say anything. She also asked for the public to help her identify the suspects. To help me get a closure on this, I need to find out what was the motive and who did it. So I'm trying to ask the public to help giving any clues as to who that person could be and why this happened. I cannot think of anybody. Crime Stoppers are offering a reward of $10,000 for anybody who has information on the suspects. Those who might have tips on the perpetrators should call the Sugarland Police Department or Fort Bend County Crime Stoppers. From NTV Houston, this is Fessel Kiyuki.